Hello again, welcome back to My Primal Christmas, day 11 today. Now, you might be thinking with all these posts from me about cutting grains and cutting sugar and living primally, how do Cormac and I deal with the holiday season and even socialising throughout the year? So I thought I would come on and talk a little bit about the 80% rule that the Primal Blueprint talks about and something that a lot of people call moderation. So deciding to live a primal life, cutting grains and sugars from your diet is not a cult following, it's not a decision to never touch these things again in your life and if you do it means you're not primal or it means that you'll be kicked out of the club. It's about knowing what fuels our body but also what hinders our health and making informed food choices every day of the year, not just during the Christmas season. Although eating unprimally is part of our lifestyle, it's a spontaneous choice. We don't set a day or a time to eat, un eat non-primally. It's just off the cuff and unless it's a specific social gathering that's already planned, we wing it. Living primarily is about getting the most out of your life. It's about health and longevity. So enjoyment of your life is a big part of that. And Cormac and I have recently been away in Europe for five weeks. This is an example of a time where we would have eaten non-primarily maybe 80% of the time. But we knew that this was short term and we enjoyed our decisions while we were there. And we also enjoyed getting back to a normal primal routine and lifestyle once the trip was over. When we were back, we didn't punish ourselves for indulging while we were away because food is not a punishment. It's also not a reward. So we wouldn't have a salad as punishment for overindulging on a night out. In the same way that we wouldn't reward ourselves with a dessert if we chose a salad on a night out or if we had had a big workout that day. Now in the Primal Blueprint, there is an 80% rule. Mark Sisson says for us to strive for 100% of compliance with the Primal way of eating, but to not get obsessive about it and to not get really upset when you fall short. This is 80% of a month or 80% of your year or 80% of your life. It's not an 80% rule on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, there are many days or weeks or even fortnights that we would go without eating anything that isn't primarily aligned. This means that when we do eat something that is grain or sugar based, we eat it and enjoy it without any guilt. So if you've been seeing my posts and thinking, well, Christy, that's all very well and good, but it is Christmas. I just want you to realize that living primarily doesn't mean you can't enjoy Christmas or enjoy the occasional indulgence, but it's about knowing that it is an indulgence and treating it that way. So thank you for watching, and remember, everything in moderation, including moderation. See you next time.